Hi, this is Connie from SmockityFrocks.com, and I wanted to tell you today about smocking. I know, fascinating, but a few people have asked me what is smocking and what are smockety frocks, so I thought I'd tell you um, smocking is needlework, and it is done mostly on little girls' dresses on teeny tiny pleats, and it's mostly an old southern tradition like embroidery on the front part of a little girl's dress. This is how it's done. This is called a pleater and it's a, a simple machine that's a crank and um, these needles are threaded with just regular machine thread or hand sewing thread and a piece of fabric is put into here and it's rolled and when it comes out the other side it comes out threaded into tiny pleats and this is an example of the finished of the finished product this is a piece of fabric that is pleated and you can see if I pulled it apart you can see that there are tiny threads holding these little tiny pleats together and this is an example of a piece that I started uh, 13 years ago for my son it has cows and this was supposed to be the beginning of a John Deere tractor but he got bigger and my husband put his foot down and said no more knee socks and little Hans and Franz outfits for the boy so anyway I wasn't through with it so anyway I never have had another little boy to give this to but I thought this was really cute a smocked piece can go on the front of a little boy's outfit just like this like a little overall outfit but mostly you see it on the front of little girls dresses and it can be picture smocking like this or it can be geometric which is just zigzags and you follow a pattern Oh, yeah. <laughs> you follow a pattern and you buy it at a smocking specialty store and it shows you, it tells you exactly what to do, the stitches to take and what colors of thread to use and everything like that. So, I've always loved smocking and I've always smocked my little girls Easter dresses and Christmas dresses and any time of year dresses. So, when it was time to name my blog three and something years ago, I thought to myself for about two and a half seconds. What name should I call it? Okay, Smockety Frocks. The issue with that now is, it, what does it mean? I don't know. I was on the airplane next to a kind gentleman on the way to the blogging conference in Nashville, Blistem, and he asked me, he was very friendly, and asked me where was I going, what was I doing, and what's a blog? So I was trying to tell him, and I gave him my business card because he was interested in it, and he said, Oh, smockety frocks, so you sell smocked garments. And I said, no, I don't. And he said, oh, to the glory of God. So it's about religious doctrine. You write about religious doctrine. And I said, no, I really don't. And he said, well, what is it about? And I was all, okay, get off my back, mister, all right? I don't know what it's about. It's about nothing, okay? It's about everything. What is your life all about, Mr. Seven seven word summation I have no idea is it would it be easy for you to come up with seven words to describe your whole entire life no no it's not easy because it's about everything it's about nothing and that's what my blog is about and so no I really didn't say that to him but ever since that time I've been thinking what is my blog about it's not about smocked garments it's not about religious doctrine but it's just about everything. It's kind of like a magazine. When you flip through Southern Living, you'll see a recipe and you'll see a, a decorating tip, a craft tip, a story, maybe a funny story. Anyway, that's what my blog is about. Just about everything and nothing all mixed up in a big pot. So, kind of like this video. It's about smocking. It's about business cards and airplane rides and smockety frocks. Anyway, thank you for joining me once again.